Prince Harry speaking out overnight, defending his decision to write that bombshell memoir that comes out tomorrow. Yeah, clearly there have been a lot of questions about this approach, and among them, a woman who knows about growing up in the spotlight of a famous family, Ronald Reagan's daughter, Patty Davis. Decades after she herself wrote a book about her family, she's sharing her advice for the prince in a New York Times op-ed over the weekend. It's called Prince Harry and the Value of Silence. Patty, good morning. It's so good to see you. Thank you. Nice to see you. Thank you for having me. Well, Hoda and I were just totally captivated by your piece in the New York Times and your perspective mm -hmm. because there are few people mm -hmm. who can really stand in those shoes. You yourself wrote a memoir way back when. Um, yeah. And, and Which we're not going to give the title of. No, we're not. And I that's so interesting. Yeah, mm -hmm. Patty, you say, you say, mm -hmm. I don't want to say the title. I, I'm done right. with that. I'm sorry I wrote it. Mm -hmm. And and you feel like Harry could learn I said something I from that. I've written many books since. Yeah. So we'll <laughs> buy those. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, so what is, like, what you, you say you regret doing it. And what's your advice for Harry now, he, him having done something similar? Well, I understand where he's coming from. I mean, obviously, the it's very complicated growing up and feeling like you're living under this huge shadow, you know, and obviously the monarchy is a much bigger shadow than being part of the first family, but it's the same, it's the same thing. You know, you don't feel, um, you don't feel like you exist as an individual. You don't feel that you are taking up space. You don't feel that you matter. And it's human nature to want to feel that you matter. So you think, well, if I just sort of, you know, open the floodgates and tell everything and, and, you know, then I'll take up space, then then I will matter, then they'll have to listen to me. The problem with that is the only thing that's taking up space is all the things that you're saying about other people, mm -hmm. you know, and like the clip that you just showed of Harry, the phrase that jumped out at me was my truth. As I said in this op-ed, that's a really narrow way of looking at things. And, mm. and I did it too, you know, this is my truth. But the full story is other people's truths also. Mm -hmm. So, you know, my suggestion in this op-ed was that silence and reflection is very, is very valuable, you know, to take a step back and try to look through a wider lens, look at the whole, picture, get some insight that way, because it's a bigger picture than just your story. Mm -hmm. Well, kind of, I guess what's done is done. He put everything in writing. It was in the Netflix <laughs> documentary as well. But yeah. there's another piece here. You got to reconciliation. And uh, Harry keeps talking about, I want to reconcile or I'm open to that. How would he possibly go about that, given what's been going on? Well, I think the only way you do it is to change within yourself. As I said, the the you know, it requires some reflection, it requires some some silence, some stepping back. And I mean, listen, you know, let, I, I'm not going to sugarcoat things. We we never did become a a close cohesive family. But I think that's part of it. You have to accept what your family is, you know, and accept what your parents brought to the table. Mm -hmm. um, I was struck in, I did watch his 60 Minutes interview last night. I was struck about his story of when his mother died and and his father had his hand on it, uh, on Harry but didn't embrace him. Well, I'd like to know what Charles's story is with, with his father. I mean, where's mm -hmm. that part of the story? Because, mm -hmm. you know, he he... I'm sure would have wanted to be a more hands-on father. I'm not sure, but I mean, I suspect. And, you know, that's part of the story, too. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. it, you know what's so interesting, Patty, is that I think you told our producer that almost immediately, like mm -hmm. even during your book tour, you kind of regretted mm -hmm. having written the book. How did you, what was the process like mm -hmm. of coming to grips with that and then coming, as Hoda was saying, to reconciliation? How did you get on that path to healing for yourself as well? You know, it was a lot of internal work. It was a lot of grief, really, yeah. to to accept that I had made a huge mistake and I'd made it publicly. I mean, it was like 40 years ago now, but it was brutal. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was, I, you know, I was like hated. I mean, I got death threats. It was it was really, really brutal. And so there was some grief in there, but there was, I also really had to just go do a lot of internal work. For me, it was a lot of spiritual work. And um, part of that, I think, was to accept that 
my family was what it was. You know, it was it was a fractured family. It was never going to be, um, I don't know, the Brady Bunch or something. You know? <laughs> Probably they weren't even functional. I don't know, but you know, <laughs> they seemed like they were. <laughs> no tell-alls on the Brady Bunch that yeah. we're aware. Yeah. <laughs> Patty, like I said, I hope people read the op-ed mm -hmm. because I, I know that you took pains to be mm -hmm. very fair to all sides and to really be thoughtful mm -hmm. and introspective about the journey that Harry is on. So mm -hmm. thank you for thank coming you, in and sharing a little bit of that. Also should mention her latest book. Yeah. We will mention this one, Floating in the yes. Deep End. Yes, about being a caregiver for those with Alzheimer's, something, of course, you know much about. Patty, thank, thank you. Thank you, Patty. Thanks. Oh, Thank right. you so much. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.